everybody, it's Mrs. Bunkera again, and I'm going to read this story to you called Planting a Rainbow by Lois Elhert. And our, this is going to be um, our theme for the week, flowers, okay? In the fall, we buy some bulbs, these little round things here. We buy some bulbs and plant them in the ground. There's all kinds. Orange tiger lily bulb, red tulip bulb, orange tulip bulb, yellow daffodil bulb, blue hyacinth bulb, sorry if I'm not pronouncing it correctly, purple crocus corm, and all of these different kinds. We order seeds from catalogs sometimes and wait all winter long. Or you can get seeds from other places too, like gardens and um, garden shops and nurseries. For spring, we wait for spring to warm the soil and sprout the bulbs. Look at all the pretty colors. Then it's time to go to the garden center to select some seedlings. <coughs> Elsie's here with me. We sow the seeds and set out the plants <coughs> in the soil. <laughs> Elsie, do you want to come up and read the book with me? <sighs> and we plant, oh, I'm sorry, and set out the plants in soil and watch the rainbow grow. Okay, look at all these. And grow, and grow. See all the colors? What's that color? What's this one? Yellow, <coughs> that one. What's this one? We have some, which color? Red flowers. <laughs> Sorry, you'll see. And orange flowers like zinnia and poppy. We have some yellow blooms, yellowish, daisy, marigold, daffodils. We grow something green like ferns. And some blue flowers, morning glories, and other ones. And some purple flowers too. Crocus, iris, violets, pansies. And when summer is over, we know we can grow our rainbow again next year. See the word rainbow? It's in different colors, all the colors of the rainbow, right? Okay, so I am so excited to talk about flowers this week and to do different activities with you about flowers. And Elsie's excited too. She might be in some of our videos. Yeah. Have a good day. Elsie, you want to wave? <laughs>